Okay, now we're going to do the nails. Now after your prep has dried, you're going to do the secure in it. So you shake it up. It's, I don't know, kind of like that Elmer's glue. It's like really, really, really pasty. See? What you do is you kind of wind it from the top and pull it straight back from the cuticle all over the nail. Make sure you do not get it on your skin because once you put it through the LED light, it will be on your skin and it will make it so your nails come up, your fingernail polish come up a lot easier. Rather than stay on, mine will stay on for three to four weeks sometimes if I do them really good, which I'm. It already took me forever to do my toes. Because you can't really do those fast. Um, what they say to do is to cap the bottom of it and then smooth it. It gives it a sealant underneath. But you want to make sure you don't get any on your skin. Because then it's going to be stuck. And I, like I said, only doing one hand at a time. You want enough, but you don't want too much. It comes with an LED light, depending on the package you buy on Ulta. You can get the portable one or the plug-in. Do not get the portable. It is not enough rays. And it's only, I think, $10 more to actually get the good quality lamp. Okay, once that's done, I will just take my little metal tool, go around my edges and make sure there ain't none stuck on my fingers. Then it comes with this light. I am not sure if you can see it. I'm doing it completely backwards so I can't see my screen. You're supposed to do your thumbs and your fingers. You can do them separate or not. Um, the light has a timer. Um, oop, I can tell some of my skin was sticking. You don't want it sticking. Um, sometimes what I will do is I'll just do four fingers, get them all the way done, then do my thumbs, or I'll do all five at one time, or just my thumbs and then my four fingers. It just depends on your preference. I sit on there for a while, and usually what I will do is when, after these four fingers are done under the light, so the light is what secures the gel to your fingers, and the light turns off automatically. Um stick my thumb under. Sometimes if it's my opposite hand, I can sometimes bring my four fingers up and do another coat of the secure. Um, but that ain't gonna work because it's gonna turn my thumb, so I'd rather not be impatient. And this is definitely a time consuming thing to do. Um, it's not something that you can hurry and do. Um, I have heard that you should recommend not getting your hands or feet wet after you do this. Like maybe don't shower, or wash your hands or anything. You do it at the end of the night. I'm doing mine at like two o'clock in the afternoon. So because I'm waiting for my husband to come home. Um you can tell how thick you want it. Um see now they're nice and shiny. Um you could do just a small little smidgen of it coat just to make it a little more thick. The thicker you get it, I think it's not going to stay as long. That's just my opinion. Everybody's different. Everybody's nails are different. Everybody's nail beds are different. Everything is different. So what I'll do is I'll finish letting just this secure. I'm going to do another four fingers and then I'll be back to do coloring.